What's good, everybody? Today, I want to talk to you guys about the San Francisco 49ers signing Kawan Alexander. I personally do not think that's a good signing because of the fact that Alexander has not been able to play a full season. Um, and then he's he just came back from an ACL injury. That's a huge, huge, huge deal when it comes to linebackers. Kwan Alexander, before his injury, was a very good player. Uh, he could have been regarded as one of the top linebackers. Right? You can say he was a top uh, 10 to 15 linebacker, right? which is very good. There's like 100-plus linebackers that are playing every year, um, and he was top 10 to 15 in, uh, percent right in that um, in the linebacker class. And one of the issues I have with with, pay, with signing him is they gave him 54 million dollars over four years uh, with 27 million in guarantees. Now, 27 is not bad, right? 27 million is not that bad. It's not that much in guarantee money. You'll probably uh, within two years you'll probably pay 20 at that 27 million. Year three, if you were to cut him, uh, you know, you'd probably take a four to five million dollar uh, cap hit. Isn't a big deal. You can always trade him too. But uh, I don't like the signing. I I think that Quan Alexander is a good player, but that's a lot of money to give to a, a linebacker coming from ACL injury. Usually, I don't think linebackers recover well. I know there's one linebacker in Dallas who did come back from an ACL injury, and uh, he's very dominant. Uh, maybe he maybe Quan Alexander can, but I think it's too soon to tell. Uh, keep in mind. Jalen Sam, uh, J Jalen Samuels also took, uh, or I'm sorry, Jalen Smith from Dallas also took two four years off from his injury, so he wasn't uh, required to come back, you know, and start producing right away because he had this massive contract, right? Uh, the Cowboys took him; it was a low, uh, low risk scenario. Um, but I, I do think that he can recover if you guys give him that time, right? Uh, I still think it was a bad move in the sense that you're going to sign him and pay him today. He recently had his injury, right? Uh, I think he had it after like six weeks or something into the regular season last year. So it hasn't even been a full year yet. You know, if, if, you, if you guys expect him to come back week one and be playing week one, I think that's too soon. Uh, now, you guys do have Malcolm Smith. I think you guys restructured his contract. I'm a Raiders fan, so I got to watch Malcolm Smith play for us. He was a very solid player. I know he got hurt last year as well, but um, he'll be a big contributor to that defense. You know, the Niners are not that far off uh, from making a solid push. They have a good quarterback, one of the best tight ends, very good offensive line, very good running system, the way, you know, they block, very, very good. Um you, they have DeForest Buckner. Hopefully, Solomon Thomas can step up. Um, you know, they have some good young players on that team. It's unfortunate that they cut Reuben Foster because of his situations. Um, but you know, they they have a lot of good pieces on that defense. Uh, now, the second overall pick, they'll probably end up taking Nick Boza or Josh Allen, which is going to give you guys as a defense a huge boost. All right, you got you pair that up with uh, you know you got you got Quan Alexander now. Uh, Fred Warner is a very good linebacker. I love him. I think he's going to be one of the best linebackers in the league. It's going to be interesting how this Niners team shapes up. Um, I still don't like this signing. I hope I get proven wrong. Uh, it'll be really interesting to see kind of what happens with Alexander. Um, I think he should not come back right away. I, I'd let him, you know, maybe get him get, get a healthy linebacker week seven, right? Um, it'll be interesting. I want to know what you guys think. Do you guys like Quan Alexander? If you're a Niners fan, are you happy that your team signed this linebacker? Are you happy with the deal? Right, four years, fifty-four million. It's a lot of money. Uh, let me know in the comments below. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. If you guys are not subscribers, I really appreciate it. And I hope you guys all have a great day.